COVID has hit us all pretty hard recently, that is for certain. But how has it affected churches since its outbreak? And on top of that, how has it affected the media part of the church? Today we'll be asking the media director at Fairfield Christian Church that very question. We will be asking him to start when he first started working at FCC and how COVID changed everything. I started working at uh, FCA three years ago. So what is this, 2021, 2018? Or oh, was it 2017? 2017, August 2017. So I don't know what it was like. I got hired at FCA to um, mentor students as an educator, instructor, teacher. And then FCC, Fairfield Christian Church, uh, recruited me after Andrew Gherkin left. And Andrew Gherkin did a lot of the scheduling, a lot of the setting up of the cameras, and uh, recording of church service. When COVID came in um, March of 2019, changed everything. Andrew left, uh, and they hired me, or recruited me to fill in until they got someone else. Only I never left. Uh, they uh, recognized the experience I had at Channel 10 for 20 years, and Oral Harvest Church for three years, and Ohio, the Ohio Center for Broadcasting for a number of, ye number of years. And then I started uh, producing primarily the online service because there was no one in the pews at church, FCC. And uh, so I don't know what it was like prior to that, uh, but I know I brought my experience and background from uh, the CBS affiliate in Columbus and all the different places I've worked at Royal Harvest Church and, as I said, the Ohio Center for Broadcasting. But uh, I brought all that experience in audio and, and television and uh, production, uh, specifically um, a stand-up comedy series, a fitness program, and I was able to use it here, and they liked it. They liked it, and uh, I discovered they liked it, and I started doing stuff relative to what I was used to. Uh, the more I did, the more I discovered they liked. And so things changed. We, we were able to uh, recruit more people. Prior to that, I think they struggled to get three or four people here. Now we have almost 20 people, which is a good problem to have because now I can schedule them, uh, not always every Sunday. Here is what one of the new recruits thinks about working with FCC. Normally it's uh, an enjoyable experience, I suppose you could say. Um, just overall, like everyone's easy to work with. I never have to, I think the most I have to deal with is probably just shy people. Um, I mean, so, I mean, like the camera work, and once you get it figured out, it's pretty much just get through it. Um, normally, of course, the speakers running around are something you have to deal with while filming. Um, but overall, the people are good, the technology is okay. Um, just satisfying experience with a lot of people that are good to work with. But uh, I think, and I'm hoping, that they are learning stuff. I'm using students from my FCA classes. I'm using former students, I'm using uh, volunteers from the church, and we're having a good time at that. So uh, it helped out a lot. That's how it changed. Uh, but again, I cannot relate it to what it was because I wasn't doing this at the time. And that is all the time we have for today, and we would like to thank Dale White for informing us about the media part of the church and wish him the best of luck in the future.